he isn't back yet. But not to worry, because actually, I've been hoping for a chance to have a nice long chat with you all day. Sorry for dragging you with me everywhere. Everyone's been so good to me, though. It's all gone really smoothly. <laughs> Feels like Paimon has barely spoken a word this whole trip. I felt like I was neglecting you guys. So, I wanted to find an opportunity to catch up. When we first met, I was in a hurry. We didn't have a chance to sit down and have a proper chat. You guys are travelers, right? So, where else did you go before coming to Inazuma? Ooh, sounds great! I heard they pretty much have no rules over there, right? So people are free to live their life however they want, doing whatever makes them happy. My pops actually received a gift from one of his old customers over there. It was from the winery or something. Don Winery! Their dandelion wine is super famous! Yes, that's the one! I remember when he drank it. <laughs> I've never seen him enjoy a bottle of wine so much in his life. He was telling me all night about how good it tasted. My friend once said to me that only people with a strong will and a clear purpose decide to go traveling. Maybe it's to see a certain view or to fulfill a certain wish. So, what made you guys embark on your treacherous journey to Inazuma? And to find the last family member, too. You were separated from your family because of a god? Oh, that must be really tough. I get it. Well, if that's how it is, then that's how it is. <sighs> you know, I was going to ask if you guys wanted to stay here in Inazuma. Unlike the outside world, what Inazuma seeks is eternity. In other words, a state of tranquility where very little ever changes. The advantage of that is that if you're ever tired from your journey, Inazuma's a great place to come and rest. Um, uh, let me put it this way. I was just worried that you might be getting weary. And if you keep pressing on in that state, you might start to lose sight of the things that made you want to start your journey in the first place. <sighs> Sometimes. That's also just how it is. When you're exhausted, everything becomes an uphill struggle. Even trying to have fun. You won't be able to enjoy yourself if you're too tired. An adventure friend of mine once told me that if you're too focused on reaching the end of the race, you'll miss a lot of opportunities and precious moments to be had along the way. Don't worry, though. I'm sure I can think of some way to get you feeling relaxed and happy. And you're here now, so even if you're gonna leave eventually, I want to make sure you at least leave with fond memories. Who knows? Once you're reunited with your family, maybe you'll find Inazuma the right kind of place to call home. <laughs> I already have an idea of the color and type of fireworks I want to give you guys. I'll keep it a secret for now, though. Yoimiya, I'm back. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting. Let's head over to the boat. Or, uh, did you want to keep chatting a little longer? Okay, good. Let's go, then. Just act naturally, though. We don't want to raise any suspicion. If it can withstand the storms out on the ocean, it must super sturdy, right? Absolutely. Rest assured that the quality is guaranteed. The dream of being... <laughs> 